Well, there's, uh, there's two aspects to that question. One is quality of life, and one is overall survival, which, of course, is quality of life. So when we're talking about quality of life, I think we're really talking about patients with cutaneous T-cell lymphoma, which is an indolent disease, uh, can lead to a very poor quality of life. And certainly, the more agents that we have for that patient population, as it's a chronic disease that work, um, the more chances the patient has to have quality of life and a longer quality of life. But when we're talking about peripheral T-cell lymphomas, I think we're not so interested, unfortunately, at this moment in quality of life, but in longevity of life, because those patients have an extremely poor outcome um, continually, even though we have new drugs. And so really, it's a much uh, higher level question of, of keeping the patient alive and accepting, unfortunately, maybe some agents that don't have the best quality of life uh, because of that pursuit. We don't have the luxury yet of, of just looking at quality of life in that patient population.